Well, like most business owners, we're all looking to build our team. So how do you build a team when you're trying to scale your business? There's a few uh, critical factors that I strongly believe are kind of the, the most important. They're not the only important, but uh, here's kind of my top three or four. And one of them is if you're looking to scale your business, you've got to grow a team that's diverse. So how do we find those people? Well, we can use, I know people hate personality tests, but somehow we have to figure out what personality this person is. Um, I like to use the DISC personality test, if you will. Uh, D's are driven, they're decisive, they don't like small talk in this personality uh, profile. Um, they're usually not detail oriented as far as uh, they, they don't like doing the paperwork, the follow up. So if you've got salespeople that they never turn in their receipts, but they're crushing it in sales, typically they would be a D. Um, but that doesn't always mean they're a D. But those are kind of things to look for. But can you imagine if you're building your team with these A players, um, not to use another letter, but A players of D type personalities? your business would never scale because no one would be left in the office invoicing, collecting payments, doing the dirty work. Uh, you, you'd have everybody out there competing for more business. And so when you're building to, or scaling your business, building your team of diverse people is very, very important. Another one is have the right tools. Uh, have, have the organization of the company laid out how you want to build, who reports to who, and then also have job descriptions, job functions, expectations, so they know what they're, they're looking for. And then I'm also asked, uh, how do I trust them once I hire them if I'm scaling? And that is, you let them trust the process. Implement, you can't scale a business, that's almost impossible, if impossible, to scale a business without SOPs, Standard Operating Procedures. So basically where everything done in the company is documented so everybody's following it the right way and the right right method. So uh, to trust your team, you have to trust your process because if they're following the process, you're, you're trusting your team. So if you'd like more business owner tips, resources, online classes, networking events, go to our boss website. That's businessownershipsimplified.com.